Hey, good evening to everyone. Hi, RKDP. Hi, Red. Hi, hi. And hello, Kathleen. Hello, hello, hello. I may sound a bit further away because I have uh, moved my, my mic to uh, a different location. So it's uh, now a bit further away, but I hope you guys can still hear me. Hello, hi, good evening, good morning, good afternoon, good evening to everyone. Hey, hey, so this is the finished product. So this is the, oops, this is the finished work from last week. Okay, so I hope you all had fun. Like it was uh, kind of fun to paint this one. So in the end, I quite, I mean, it looks a bit, oh, hold on. Is it like not very, hello, oh my God, hello, Senia, hello, hi, hi. Senia, you're here, it's the first time we see her. Hello, everyone say hi to her. She's um, last, I think the you you submitted your work last, the last time, right, where we had our last uh, challenge. And just like your first time, like, finally um, saying hi to us in the in, in, in our live stream so hi yes it's a happy Friday today is Friday and uh, yeah it's it's a uh, I am I, I actually <laughs> am still <laughs> drying my hair so I may have to off the volume a little like I will turn it off so that I can dry my hair and you you people can just discuss talk about stuff and Kathleen has been really really good because she has already done all three colors like all three paintings um so just a little recap like for this month uh, it is uh, Dominica. So the, I, re I realized that's Dominican public and this is another place called Dominica. So it's a different place uh, from Dominican Republic. Republic. Yeah. <laughs> so it's different. And hello, Gypsy. Gypsy. So one, 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 one. Yeah, I know you're Cindy. Hello. Hi, Cindy. Good morning. And hi, Nancy. Hi. Good morning, Nancy. Yay. Yes. So give me a minute. No, give me five minutes. I <laughs> Let me dry my hair. Uh, uh, and, and you guys can just like discuss, okay? Talk talk to your talk to each other and uh, yeah what do you think of the new the the palette do you like or do you hate the palette okay give me a moment
Okay, I'm back. <laughs> Alrighty, so yes, tonight, uh, let me just take off that banner, the ticker. All right, yo, yo, there. So yeah, yeah, I, I, yeah, which is why it's difficult because I actually wanted to do um, landscape, but because there's no green, it was so hard. I, I don't know what to do. Um, and I thought, yeah, since we haven't done like animals for a while, let's see what I can do. And realize it's actually okay. Like it doesn't, you don't really need green. I mean, it'll be nice to have greens and yellows, but I think it's okay, you know? So, uh, which is why today we are painting a squirrel. <laughs> I don't know how many of you like squirrel or hate squirrel. Like I love them. I think they are so cute, so elusive. <laughs> like there is, um, they always scurry around. Like scur they, 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 would, they would just scurry off, you know? Oh, actually, this one has a lot of green. Okay, I'm so sorry. Okay, I'm going to just show you guys uh, what I will be doing. Uh, let me just show you guys what is going on over here, okay? There, hold on. Let me check. So I do. I actually have two photographs, um, two reference photographs. Let me know if I'm sounding a bit like far away because I am not. My microphone is slightly off. Like it's on the side. So if you don't hear me very well, uh yeah, let me know. Okay. Um yeah, let me just put this on the screen so that you guys can see what's going on. Oh, you like them? Yeah, I love them. So it's really weird. Oh, oh, RKDP says he has a Elvis squirrel. What? <laughs> you have an, what do you mean Elvis squirrel? <laughs> do you mean an El, a, a squirrel in a Elvis suit or, or something? Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 okay, I, um, back, okay, I'm, I'm from Singapore, right? So we don't really see, uh, no, we do have squirrels, but our squirrels are not as, um, bold as those that we see like i've been to like i've um, been to the states um a long while back and what i realized in like the squirrels in the states and in, in canada is that they are they are kind of bold like they, they just they just walk around they just do all sorts of stuff and you can chase them and they don't really mind it you know what i mean uh, but in singapore it's really rare like if i see a squirrel like somewhere somewhere or even on a branch, I'll be, oh, I, I will think to myself, it is uh, my lucky day that day. So let me just show uh, the squirrel that I will be doing. Um, oh, am I already sharing? Yeah, so there you go. So this is a, a squirrel that I would be doing. I hope that it would, okay. Is this good, better? It's like too big? Is it too big? I'm not sure if it's too big. Yeah, this is, yeah, okay. Probably like this. Okay, so I, uh, yeah, we'll see if I, I can get this one. I have to change the color a little bit because you realize, uh, I realize that it's quite a bit of uh, green in here. So I will probably have to use the blue instead of the green. So I'm not sure how that's going to go. But I have to make sure that I do give a lot of, like, um, especially the fur. I think the fur will be hard to, to paint. I, I already have my gouache ready. So like, oh, wait, let me just share. It's fine? Really? You think so? Yeah, I think it's okay. Because the squirrel doesn't have to be, like, I we do have quite a lot. Too. If you look at our palette, the colors, right? If you look at the colors that we have, um, we do have like colors that are, yeah, I mean, these colors are actually fine. Like, um, yeah, they, these are actually okay for just the, like, I think they are right color for the squirrel, but just the, the you know, the, the background, I may have to kind of change the um, greens to blues and maybe just have the squirrel stand with the sky, like he's standing at the sky and something like that. We'll see how that goes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, so let me just do the necessary. So just to kind of share the final piece. Remember last week I struggled? <laughs> did I struggle? I think I did. So I was just kind of like painting this uh, dry uh, dahlia, right? It doesn't even look like a dahlia. It looks like a, I think it's like a chrysanthemum or something, right? Um, yeah, so today uh, you shall not, I think it should be okay. Like if I do it slowly, it should be okay. Okay, I am going to... I hope you can still hear me because... Uh, 
yeah you if you, you guys are okay right you can't you can hear me right i've got oh, oh nancy saying it's fine is it for the the cat the, the video like the, the the sound like it's okay you could hear me yeah i hope it's good okay so this is yeah i'm gonna start it's gonna be just like this okay so yeah how's um preparation for black friday that's gonna be next week oh it's thanksgiving's next week so how's preparation anyone doing anything special meeting out with family uh you know shopping i don't know if it's still is it already shopping time um so i did a bit of change to my um, setup just maybe i'll just share like my setup okay so see it's movable okay i hope i can Ah, okay, so uh, you know how like I don't really have space over here. Like it's it's the wall, like it's the wall. Okay, so um yeah, I have my setup. This is the computer over here, and then there's another screen over here. So this is a computer screen over here. And uh wait, hold on. Okay, so I've I've moved all my art stuff here, and uh, the this is for painting like the, the the pen this is the water container and my ipad is here um and also uh, the art stuff so i i just decided to move all my art stuff uh, over okay because i i realized i keep like losing like I, I i don't have a kind of a common space to keep all these stuff um so yeah that's how it is <gasps> oh hippo oh thanksgiving is not even here and we're already tired of each other no i'm not <laughs> why do you say that we are not we, are, we love each other no <laughs> no we are we are kind of tired of like having crappy crappy palettes so i think hippo has a very good suggestion we will try to implement it next year uh where we will have like interesting like um palettes that make sense so i am no the good thing about having my um, art supply like over here is that now i don't have to walk behind the the room like my my desk to get my washi tape because i have my washi tape here yay oh referring to your family oh no <laughs> No, it can't be as bad as uh uh you know with COVID um during COVID time where you're like stuck in the house with them. I guess that would be that was even worse. I remember it was um yeah, it was just tough times then where all of us just kind of bumping around at home, bumming around at home. And and you just get on each other's nerves. And then I remember when we all had to like like work from home and we had to share. But I don't have to, so I was I'm pretty lucky. I know there are some people who had to share rooms, uh, share the table with the computers and they're having classes together and that was pretty bad. So I'm sure those people at that time, you, you, you uh, definitely uh, get tired and sick of each other. So that was that was then. Now, now I think there's this uh, revenge, travel revenge coming up and a lot of people are going on holiday. Uh, I'm not because I'm already done with all my holiday. So if I have time today, I'll share... Uh, the stuff that I got, I've done um, during my trip to Korea. Just came back last month. Oh my God, like time flies. And I am back to the grind. <laughs> and I am seeing all my uh, colleagues going on holidays because it's a school holiday and a lot of uh, parents are bringing the kids off. Yeah. All right. So today is squirrel, right? I hope my squirrel look like squirrel today. A squirrel should be easy. I don't think it will take me a long time to paint. Uh, well, let's start, okay? So as I am saying, um, the palettes, let me just kind of recap the palettes. The, the I, am I, have I, I have it, I'm not, okay. So the palettes, the colors in our Dominica palette are uh, PB29, about blue, PB14. So it could be PB62 as well. Because I, I actually finished, I, I, I'm lazy. <laughs> this is PB14 from uh, Winter Newton. Um, and I also have a cobalt blue, no, no, cobalt violet hue. Is it? Or is it just cobalt violet? I don't remember. But this is from Hobin and it's PV62. So I'll be using this in place of this slight color difference, but not too much. Um, and then we have Queen Burned Orange, like one of my favorite colors. Still my favorite. Like I, I have to hop hot on this. And then we have the Burnt, Sien the burnt Umber, which is, um, it's too hot around, okay? It's too hot, um a current uh, least favorite color <laughs> it's also one of my least favorite color um because it's just 
it's just so unnecessary. I don't know. It's just to me a very unnecessary color because you don't really need this. Anyone here, like what's your least favorite color? What's your least favorite color, Nancy? Do you have one? What's everyone's least favorite color? Like, can you guess? I'm sure you guys know like what's my least favorite color, right? Because everyone knows <laughs> my least favorite color. Okay, so uh, let me start by taking out my pencil. Oh my god, I'm so happy I actually like like organize all my things and everything. I don't have to walk away to do stuff. So there you go. Um, so if there's anyone want to share their least favorite color, I think mine is probably uh, dioxazine violet. If you guys know, I'm sure you guys know. Okay. And uh, how about hip hippo? What have you have you done? Oh, hey, Greg. Hello, howdy, howdy. Oh, very tired this morning. What do you do? Oh no, do you get a hangover or something? It's probably too, uh, like early in the week to be hangover. No, <laughs> how are you? How are you? <laughs> hey, hey. Have you done your three blind mice? Is it three blind mice? You know how I we all have been now. Uh, we are all waiting. Um, I am like I'm so super excited um, to 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 uh, see what uh, Greg is doing uh, for his uh, anything goes week or I don't know it could be also a bit of flora and 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 everything like mixed together so I am looking forward to that yeah okay let me adjust. I need to adjust this to 69. No, 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 no. 15, 4, 7, 5. I think 7, 5 is okay. Okay, let me just adjust this a wee bit because I want a bigger uh, squirrel. Okay, I'm going to have him just stand. Wait, hold on. Okay, I'm adjusting the um, um, zoom on him because, uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Okay, that's probably it. Oh, you're trying out new painting apps? Nice. Oh, you know, iPad Pro. Oh, what? <laughs> That's good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I remember it's November. And I remember that, um, what's that? Procreate has is coming up with something, right? An animation app. Oh, it's something that I should try. I think we it was mentioned. I think Zuhan mentioned it. Like there's this new app. Um, yeah, I should I should go check it out to see if it's uh, available for download and, and just have fun playing with it. So what what app are you what app are you using? Or are you trying out? Oh Greg says, oh no, my friend came to town. Oh, and you stayed up late talking. Okay, that's okay. That's good. <laughs> that's really nice. I think it's always a, a good time. Like it doesn't matter what, you know, like it's always a good time to to just have like meet your friends and have a good chat, you know. Yeah, you don't have to wait till a special occasion, but of course you'd be good if they are like back for some reason. Oh, I, I realized my my squirrel's gone. It's it's so big, but I, I think it's necessary to have a big squirrel. Now let me think about. <laughs> let me think about this. It might be a little bit like too big and loop sided. Is it too bright? Uh, okay, RKD pieces. Uh, that he has posted his Elvis. Uh. Squirrel, okay, in the general chat, okay. Uh, right, I think I have, I probably have Discord here as well. So just let me quickly go to Discord and check. Ah, Procreate, uh, Adobe Fresh, ah, okay. Good to know. Infinite, 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 infinite painter and heavy paint. So which is the one that you, you, you try? Oh, as in you're using all these, What's the difference? Like I do have an iPad Pro, but that was like 2020, 2018. My version's probably 2018, I think. What's the difference like between I I, I don't know, like because I've been using my iPad since forever, but I don't really do a lot of like painting or like or drawing on it. Um, I, I draw, but it's not like a major part of my life. Like I, I just draw for fun of it but it's not something that i i do like much yeah so i must say i'm pretty amateur when it comes to like digital drawing you know ah it's so cute like i hope i can do it properly like i'm sketching you know i'm not i'm not exactly i'm not doing a, a, a scat i'm not doing a, a, a i'm not tracing so i am hoping i could actually do this like <laughs> squirrel properly 
Ah, uh, it's now looking a little bit weird. Like it's looking so weird. <gasps> what you fold? Oh, you finished them all? Wow! Now you're considering adding one or two more. Wow! What's wrong with you people? Why are you all so good? <laughs> I feel so horrible. <laughs> oh, okay. Ah, uh, so cute. Okay, RK. <laughs> Ah, uh, so cute, so cute. Uh, RKDP, I think you 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 have it on, you submitted it to, you sent it to me privately, I think. I should, like, I will share it. I think what I'll do is I'll, sh oh wait, did you already? Oh yeah, you did. Okay, okay. <laughs> yes, I see that. I see that one. Oh, so cute. I'm gonna like it. Okay, so everyone out, let me just kind of share, share the screen again. Okay. Let me stop the screen. I'm gonna share our this one. Where's my Discord? All right, share. So if you guys can, oops, can see on Discord. So we have uh this Elvis. Oh, so cute. This Elvis. Um, um <laughs> what's this supposed to be actually? This is like his little tail, right? Bushy tail, and it's kind of like goes up and it ends on his head. That's <laughs> so cute. What is this actually? It's just really like uh, for fun or like what was it? What's it? <laughs> it's a little cute stuff. Thanks for sharing that. I love squirrel. I think squirrels like are my favorite, like one of my favorite animals to play, like to, to watch or to see. I do hope like if I see them, you know, I, 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 I would like to play, like kind of chase them around just for the fun of it. Yeah. Oh, the new processor. Oh, yeah, I know, I know. Yeah, 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 the M1. Was it M1? I know, I know, I know. They did, they did. Oh, is it now, now M2? Whoa. And you're now painting with your new traditional hobby wash. Ah, it even started. It's okay. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. <laughs> we still have time. So next week is portrait. And then after that would be like our show and tell. So that's still some time, you know. Mm-hmm. Oh, the apps have um different users. Okay. Oh, you more familiar with Procreate. I think Pro Procreate is probably the only one that I've used before. <laughs> I thought I used the rest though. Ah. <laughs> I, I you know like how when you are doing something that you like, it does not you somehow time just fly by. It's just easy to do. That's why you know I think sometimes that like, I I think it's it's good to find out like what really clicks like for you. So um, it makes you like, it makes things easy. You know, like what maybe you're in flow state, you know how they, this is like buzzword about flow. They're saying like, you know, if you are doing something that you really like and you're really good at, um, you get to the state where you kind of forget stuff, like forget that your your kind of um, uh, things around you and you just kind of so absorbed that you forgot to go to the toilet, you forget you're hungry and stuff like that. So, my, my squirrel really looks weird, so I'm going to erase this, okay, um, and restart. I'll tell you, you know, sometimes uh, <laughs> I'm not good today. Like, I'm not good at painting like drawing, so I'm going to redo this, okay? I have time. I have time. I don't think this is going to take too long because it's just one squirrel. That's not like millions of, like, petals, you know, that we have to do. <sighs> yeah. So, Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay i'm looking forward to see like something something special from you got me so excited like um greg <laughs> because he it's not just four like i i was so shocked when you said like you're gonna do four and now you're gonna do six so i am i don't know should we give you a special prize the one who uh who, who over who who, who uh, the one who did everything who, who did the uh what was asked and and more you know i think you, you deserve a prize for it <laughs> so i i think recently um Zuhan mentioned that there is a little storm like tropical storm approaching uh fiji where he is so i i hope he's okay if uh Zuhan or like um, foolish one if you're around do give us a like hi you know wave and we'll say hello so that we know you're okay because it's always um i don't know how it will be i have not been through one like a, a tropical storm so i i, I can't i you know i i don't think i can understand how difficult or how how terrible it might be but it's always scary it sounds really really scary so i hope he's okay yeah <laughs> maybe 
<laughs> oh, okay, okay. No, but it's fine. I think it's important to to catch up with your friends and family. That's pretty the probably one of the one of the most important thing uh, for anyone. You know, family is always important. Um, so yeah, don't worry about this. You know, you know the reason. Um, I tell you, <laughs> I can't draw today. I don't know why. Like oh, it's so out of proportion. <laughs> oh no! How do you guys draw animals? I feel like I. I just have to be slow. I just have to do this slowly, I think. And not think of it as like a shape. I just have to think of it as like colors and shapes. And not too much like, you know, what I like. Oh, like I shouldn't think of it as like, oh, this is his hand. This is his little paw. He's holding a little stuff with his hand. It's more like, oh, this is a straight line. This is a patch of like dark shadow, you know. I should think of it this way, you know. It's gonna be so easy. <laughs> I might even end early today. I don't know. I hope <laughs> because it's so small. I don't know. Hey, Juan, yo, how are you? I hope. Yeah, you okay? Phew, that's good. Oh, it wasn't too strong. Oh, nice. <gasps> what? Five a.m. No. <laughs> what time is it? Like where you are, Nancy? I, I feel bad sometimes. Like I feel like sometimes that's just really not like I, it's not within my control. <laughs> I feel so bad. Like what time is it where you are? Is it like six, six o'clock? Six ish? So early. I feel so bad. Please go back to sleep if you are feel, still feeling tired, okay? Because I, I think it's important to get enough sleep. I think that's one of the that's something that I've always like been telling myself to do. Um, and something that I haven't been doing, I feel sometimes I want to beat myself up for it. Um, yeah, because I know, you know how important sleep is. And I feel like I, I sometimes like, uh, just spends too much time on the internet at night. So I, I can, I tend to like, not like sleep enough, you know? So, yeah. So, mm. Oh, my squirrel looks weird. Like, what's weird about him? Let me think. I think this is too small. So I have to, like, draw it bigger, I guess. And this one is kind of smaller. Oh, I tell you, today I can't draw. Ah! Oh, and kept my finger on this. Oh, oh, it's 6.30. Oh, my God. So early. Nancy, do you always wake up this early or it's just for the live stream? You know, I cannot imagine myself having to wake up like, I mean, sometimes, like, um, when I go to work, sometimes I, most of the, okay, I've been waking up really early to go to work. But that's because I need to go to work. <laughs> so I wake up at, like, five-ish. Um, but if I have a choice, I would, like, I would rather, like, sleep a little bit more. And I, I guess that everyone would actually uh, do that, you know. I tell you, I'm so bad at this next time if we're doing animal i will i will trace it <laughs> i'm struggling i'm struggling to draw a squirrel oh my god so i am happy that um ah okay okay that's good good that you can go back to sleep yay awesome so it's good that i um, happy to know that um it's not the very bad storm for Zuhuan and and yeah, he's still able to paint. You know, I have this worry, like, oh no, what if like his like what his watercolor paper gets like all wet, <laughs> like the uh, storm like dissolves it or something, you know? So I, I I'm glad that it didn't happen. Yeah, yeah. Yesterday you were still you were still like kind of talking about um, Prince Charles, right? And and the royal family. Oh my God, what happened to his hands? Oh, I'm so bad today. So anyway, um yeah just to just to let you guys know like next i think tomorrow there is gonna be a little um, exhibition by the uh, singapore sketches um not urban sketches so they are like called the sg sketches and these are the people who um you know were free i think quite a few sketches or like urban sketches make up uh this little group um, of people who uh, I guess sketch, but not like from 
uh, observation. You know how urban sketches, right? Where they we actually go to a location and we sketch the location. So the SG sketches are people who would draw from like reference photograph. I, I guess it would be like, I would say like people who sketches, they are not like professional artists, but they are like just amateur. And they call themselves the, the Singapore sketches. I, I feel like he's, Emma, can you guys see my little, yeah. Oh, squirrels are my favorite animals. I find it hard to. Yeah, they are so tough. Why are they so cute and so hard? I find like dogs are easier. I don't know. Is it me? <laughs> I have, I'm, I'm glad like Greg thinks so too. Oh, Nancy says, if I'm reading or playing cards, I might not get to sleep until the next day. What? What do you mean? Huh? What? What's. Oh, Elizabeth. Uh, Ever Queen of Singapore? No, she's never. I don't think she is ever. We will be under her. Wait, I think before we gained, so Singapore got got um gained independence in 1965. So I believe before that we were we were British colony. Um so I when did she start like when when did she start to rule? When did she start her? Oh, I don't remember. Like, I really don't. Okay, let me just kind of check. Okay, I'll Google this. When uh, Queen Elizabeth... You got me there. Like, I have no idea. Let me check. When did she ascend? Uh, she was Queen from... Okay, 1952. So I guess, yeah, for like eight, five, 13 years, maybe she was like our queen for a while. We got independence in 1965. She, she became queen in 1952. So it was a good few years that we were, I think. Yeah. But, hmm. Ah, you're raising this. Ah. <laughs> squirrels are so hard. Why are squirrels so hard? He has to be like kind of fat. I don't know. I think it's just maybe I should turn it around. Yeah, I should, huh? Yeah. Okay, hold on. I was just saying I'm talking about the um the Singapore sketches, right? So they are having an exhibition uh this weekend. And um so, right? I think you you guys no 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 what what why did it turn? I'm not sure if um remembers your art who has always been like taking part uh in our uh, limited palette. She she is uh part of the Singapore sketcher, SG sketches, and she she is taking part in this exhibition. Oh wait, hold on. Why did it turn? Like it's not supposed to. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I think the best way to sketch this is to turn it upside down. <laughs> they move too fast. <laughs> yeah, they do, they do. But I like I like them. They are so cute. So I'm gonna like turn this around. I hope that it would make drawing easier. Because then I wouldn't be, you know, it won't be confounded um by by what I I think I see, you know, I think I saw. And you would be, yeah, I, I made so much mistakes. So, yeah, that's a little tip, okay? I, I hope that would make sense to you guys. Like, it, <laughs> people always wonder, like, why? Like, how? What? Why am I doing this? So, I, and I, this is kind of small. So, yeah, I, I'm not just wondering whether it should be this small. Yeah, maybe it should be bigger. Yeah, maybe I'll do a big squirrel. Okay, I changed my mind. So, I'm going to resketch this. Oh my god, this is so tough. But it's okay, we will manage. Okay. We will manage this. We will do that. I'm gonna just do this. And I'm gonna make him like like that. He's gonna be like this size. Okay. I'm not gonna. Yeah, it's not, not easy. So yes, let's go. Um This is gonna be you know I, I think it's important to be able to, to sketch this out properly because you know I don't not sure if you guys um 
heard of this I, like it's always um it's a, a, advice that if your sketching is done well you have like done uh most of the job right properly like the paint would be easy if you sketch it well so i have to make sure that i sketch it properly i'm really i really i'm thinking like this one is a little bit off so i may need to adjust this a little bit and then like here i got to think through this a little bit um yeah so i hope this works but i think it's okay you know let's let's just try this one out i'm not an expert i'm just trying out i'm just trying i am uh <laughs> i'm like you guys I'm, I'm learning you know i'm trying it out so i hope that this would actually make the sketching uh, more accurate because then i am actually looking at the shape and the uh, lines and doing it properly okay so yeah i'm hope i'm hoping i'm hoping so I've already gotten, um, let's just talk a little bit about uh, my like life and stuff. So uh, yeah, I am really realized that this, this is November, right? Like this is like my 10th year doing art uh, in a more, I, I would say like an, as an artist, but more like I, I that I restarted art um, after like not touching any art material for so long um yeah so I, I i started in 2013 okay um yeah after i got a kind of a less demanding job where i had a little bit more life with life balance i i started like just kind of like exploring stuff that i like to do um and then i i, I found you know those nice people at the urban sketches and then i i i yeah, and I realized like, I started liking art, um, just kind of learning, doing stuff, and yeah, it was it's a nice journey. So how how's your life like? How how's your art journey like? Like everyone else, like anyone want to share their art journey? Okay, I don't know. Like this squirrel is still looking kind of weird. Yeah, but uh, okay, let's just turn this around and see if it looks totally weird. I hope it's not. Like hopefully, it looks better now. Trace it. <laughs> Nessie says, <laughs> you raised too much, you pull a hole in the page. Okay, okay. Yeah, I think now it looks a little bit better. Okay, I will stop. I think this is okay. <laughs> it looks, oh, it still looks odd though. But yeah, it's okay. I will, uh, it's fine. It's fine. I'm okay. I, I can do this. Okay, I can do this. It's looking a bit like, better i feel i think it's looking a little bit better okay i shall start to paint i think it's looking better and i, I think i am confident to start painting it's gonna be um yeah okay it's all right So for next month, we are planning to do something a little bit different for the limited palette challenge. Uh, more details to come. Um, I'm excited. I think it'll be fun. <laughs> it's unexpected. It will be fun. Um, it's just something that we will. It's just weird to have that like uh, th that challenge uh, in 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 what it you know given that we have been doing what I've been doing for so long. It'd be kind of weird that we attempt this particular challenge, but it'll be fun. Uh, more details to come. And uh, yeah, let's let's uh, let's paint this guy. Okay, I feel so bad that I have been starting this. I've done this for, I'm doing this for so long, and we're still like kind of stuck at, at the sketching part. <laughs> okay, yay! Okay, so yes, okay. Greg says this is my fifth year. I started April first or eighth in. 2018. How was it? How have you? Um, do you think that? Uh, how how do you feel about it? Do you feel like you have improved, uh, or do you feel like it has changed? Do you feel like you're still liking it, or has your like trajectory changed or, or anything like that? And Gypsy says, "Oh, I we found my art three. Oh, we found your art three weeks before you retire. Oh, you're gonna be a commercial artist." 
oh, you wanted to be a commercial artist out of high school, but that did not happen. Ah, okay. So what, what did you do? Did you go and become a teacher or, or something else? Like, why, why did you not, like, become an artist? Was it, like, just, yeah, why? You know, I, I've been, like, thinking about this idea a long, long time about, like, for a long while, like, if I should do art more, like, in a free, in a full-time, full-time. Because, you know, I, I have a normal life. Uh, I mean, a like, day job. And, uh, and it's uh, quite demanding uh it th there's like like uh, ups and downs there's like sometimes where i really have a lot of work so i don't really have at those times i feel like i didn't really have much time to paint and it makes me very tired it makes me very you know it just makes life a little bit less bearable at those times and and of course when when i have like the the when 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 you know the work is uh, less stressful uh i i, I get some some sort of uh, resolve to I, I get to do more art and that that kind of like helped me to go back to getting a like to be more normal you know like to back to my normal self so it, this is uh, something that 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 is always on my mind for some reason okay ah okay all right is it too like like too bright right let me just adjust the the the, the lighting a little bit because i'm finding it a little bit too overexposed let me adjust this a bit. Okay. Okay, I'm hoping to make the exposure a little bit. It's on the video, right? And I'm gonna, yeah. Is it better? Oh, it's too dark now. Oh, no, it's too bright. A little bit more. No, too much. Okay, I hope this is good. And I'm gonna kind of like auto-focus it a little bit. Okay, so that it's good. Is it better now? Is it better focus right now? There. <laughs> so Hippo knows what's going on. Okay, so Hippo, shh. <laughs> let's have a little surprise. <laughs> Hippo knows what we're gonna do next. Next, I think if you guys read Discord, you probably know what's gonna happen. <laughs> so yeah, Cindy says I. Oh, you never watercolor until you're going to love it. Nice. Yes. I, I think I've been doing watercolor and sketches for so long. For 10 years now. So yeah, it's it's really a, a kind of a I, I don't I don't regret going into it. And I think Nancy says she has been doing art on and off for years. Occasionally she finds a sketch food and wonder why I haven't improving drawing people <laughs> oh i okay i must say i feel like after doing all these like limited palette challenge and all the portraits that i have to do every month i feel like i am better now at drawing people but i still trace so but i'm not so scared like if you if i were to make like if you were to make me to like draw a portrait i would feel like i that's i wouldn't say no you know yeah Oh, you became a waitress. Ah, okay. <laughs> That's okay, you know, if you like it. <laughs> oh, you're not where you want to be, okay. But you definitely improved since then. Yeah, I don't I can't believe you actually just started five years ago because those mice and uh, how you actually did was so good. Like all the landscape and all those like stories that you did, the illustration. That was really, really that's really, really good, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> and Nancy says, I am tracing my hands and decorating abstract scener scenarios. <laughs> yeah, people are so people drawing people is hard. I think it's the most difficult thing. Uh, I don't know, my squirrel looks weird, but I am uh, ready to accept it. Um, I think the ears are a little bit small. So let me just make this his ears a bit bigger. Maybe I should draw like the color, the, the patterns on his the colors on his face. So that he looks uh, good enough, you know, he looks uh, more defined. <laughs> I'm gonna try my best. Yeah. So yeah, I, I yeah. Mm. It's a it's an interesting journey, you know, um, art, and and just kind of knowing like minded people. I think that's probably one of the most fun thing to the best thing part that I get from this is knowing people who are also doing art and, and, and just finding a community is, is one of the best things because 
you when you know people who have the same uh interests it's easier for you to to click and 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 easier for you to you know um, help each other and aid each other on you know learn new things together and and, and yeah it's just uh one of the best thing ever okay all right i don't care i think i'm ready <laughs> Oh, you need some tracing. Oh, okay. I really concept art. Yeah, it's such a foreign term for me, concept art. Very interesting thing. Okay. I am going to start painting finally. I'm so sorry. Take me so long. <laughs> Took me about an hour to sketch the just a little simple squirrel. Ah, I don't regret it. It's a simple, but yeah, but it's actually not a simple subject. Like I, I'm underestimating this thing. Ah, uh, then I move into oh, and uh, Nancy says she then she moved into computer concept art using PNGs and juice. Oh, what's your oh? So on Nancy's Nancy's art eleven, do you have the full that that slide show of all the concept uh, art that you made? And people says, if you want to get better at drawing people, you should try drawing people new. Ah, okay. They have drawing figure groups in most city between 10 to 12 for a few hours to hire a model. Yeah, I, I guess. Like, but what, what makes it so different from uh, drawing it from a picture? Like, is it because you could observe um, the, the body muscles and, and the shapes and uh, in, in, like, in real life? That, is that the, what's making the difference? Like, I, I know, like, some people, I, I read a few books on drawing, and, and they are saying, like, for people, right, um, it's important to know the skeletal structure. I think, I think it goes with all anatomical drawing. Like, you should, you should kind of learn where the bones are. So if you're draw, drawing a cat or dog, you should kind of know where... Uh, the bones and, and how things are kind of connected so that you know like how they would, should actually look with the fur and everything. And and I mean, same goes for people, you know. So I think, I, I, I don't know. I don't know how that's going to work. I, but I know there's some people, especially like the, the sketches, like people who really draws very well, people. I've seen uh, some of them just draw scattered, like skulls and, and they're like so impressive. They're so good at it. And I, I'm always like in awe, like, wow. <laughs> How do they do that? Okay, I, I'm gonna paint this guy here. Okay, uh, let's go. I, I have a feeling, I have a feeling that I might be using like a lot of gouache today. I try not to, okay. I, I'm still like kind of thinking how, how I should paint this. Gosh, this feels like something that's pretty difficult. Ah, new helps a lot, okay. Clothes add a new level of complexity. Oh no, that's scary. <laughs> Feels really scary. And he says, oh, problem. Our picture solves. Photos solve the drawing, okay. Live drawing teaches you faster and more cons comprehensively. Ah, okay. Interesting. I've not tried drawing people like, like mutes before. Mm. I'm not sure if I will actually do it. Mm, okay. I did take a drawing class when I was younger, but felt intimidated by all the artists around me because I was in high school and the artists were all elders. Ah, okay. Ah, that's that's interesting. Um I've I think when I, I've never taken like arts classes like with 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 like old people or like elders. I I think i my art classes were like really keep like children's art classes. Oh yeah, it has become warm, like kind of more warm. Okay, let me just adjust it a bit. Is it getting more warm? Yeah, is it better? I, I think I've taken classes, but with uh with other kids, you know, like in the in those children classes, crayon classes, they're probably one of those first classes that I take in my life. And uh I, I, I don't know. Like I believe we didn't really we were all like just playing a fool, you know, in, 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 in uh when we were young. So it wasn't 
it wasn't too intimidating, but I, I guess for us, it was really more like, you know, life just had to happen. I have to be in, in school. I have to, you know, work on my math. I got to work on my whatever else, you know, that, that, that art is like, nah, <laughs> it's just for fun, you know? So it's just these things that kind of stopping uh, my endeavor to, to be an artist. So that's, that's about it. That's how it is. Hello, Chris. Hello, how are you? <laughs> what is it about sausage? <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> you are out shopping. Nice. Are you having a, are you doing your Christmas painting? Uh, sorry, Christmas shopping? Or is this a pre Black Friday thing that they are doing? I, I realize that a lot of uh, shops are now doing like pre black friday and and just kind of like giving out doing a lot of like promotion you know just just like that like it, it, it's not even uh black friday and they are already doing all the promotions are you already like are you like doing this kind of thing like going out to just have uh going out to shop for lego <laughs> are you are you what 60 oh no oh no oh no that's too many that feels really scary like why were you in a group of like why were you like a young kid in a group of 60 like artists like feels pretty scary like i would feel too like very intimidated as well ah and greg says ah okay i took one class back in middle school but we mostly did sculpture though ah okay sculpture's fine such sculpture's quite kind of fun i think as well um, I think that there's just so many different art forms. You know, we can never do anything, like try out everything. But I, I'm glad that, um, yeah, I had a chance to really do like, like learn art. So it's like, with even if it's just, you know, um, crayons, it's, it's, it's fun. Because, you know, every time, but the thing about when, you know, the, um, doing art when, when as a kid is, you, you kind of, I feel it's just you trying to copy what the teacher or the teacher trying to force you to paint in a particular way, you know, um, like, oh, you know, this is, I'm going to teach you to do this and, and just follow, you know. Yeah, so that, that's about it. Mm, so different. I, I kind of find, have fun with the tail. Ah, okay, just food. Food is good, food is fine. I like it. I think it's nice to always go out to buy like is it like to buy groceries for, for home to 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 uh, okay I'm just gonna put this a bit closer because you know I, I think it's a bit far. <laughs> so now yes I am there you go. Hello Gina, hi hi. Oh you got up early. Yeah, Nancy was so early today. She she said she woke up at like five i'm so surprised i don't know how she did it <laughs> it's just so crazy okay i am going to switch to a smaller brush okay i'm hoping that i would be able to get the details okay uh with the smaller smaller brush not sure how how much but it's it's nice to have like these like um, burnt umber may be um, a, 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 a kind of a, not our favorite color, but I think it's it's useful. Like if you, it just helps save you a lot of time. You know, you don't have to spend time mixing a, a dark value color. So that's that's the best thing about having burnt umber. And um, yeah, I'm I'm quite I'm quite happy to have this in the palette like now actually. Because then I don't have to mix all these up. Oh, okay. You join. You join with a friend who was from Singapore. <gasps> what really? Where's she? Do you are you still in contact with her? Oh, you went to a school where it was a international community. Oh, that's really nice. Oh, Greg says my mom did art for a while. She did mosaic and taught in school for a while. Oh, oh, you are from like art background. Like most of you are like which is which is good. I, I always wonder how it is like to have like to to know to have people to know people who actually uh, are like artists uh, and and to paint with them. You know, I, I I think it's it's just so interesting to be able to just talk to people, 
uh, close to you and, and just discuss about like techniques and art. Yeah. So envious. You know how difficult it is to be artist here in Singapore? <laughs> yeah, because, you know, it's it's about, uh, you know how Asians are, right? It's about, uh, you know, uh, are you like, are you, are you going to make it big in, in, in your life? Do you think this is going to be a good uh, work for you? Do you think you can earn enough? You know, stuff like that. It's always, yeah, it's just things that we, we will ask or like it's something, things that, that would stop us um, from pursuing what we like. So yeah, it's, well, I, I guess it's a uh, common, like we get that like in a lot of time. There. And then Nancy says, you took art in high school as elective and did a lot of mixture to explore remembering. Ah, okay. <laughs> and Niwaho is fun. I like his work very cheery. <laughs> Chris always has a different way of looking at things. <laughs> if I tilt my head to the left and look at a squirrel tail, it looks amazing. Clubs. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think here, right? It does. <laughs> I think Chris always has very good um, imagination. I'm, I'm so amazed by people here. Like, I, uh, so many people have very, like, very creative. They think out of the box. So I think Chris is just one of them. I feel like my my um, cobalt blue is very um, cerulean bluish. You guys think? Do you think <laughs> something is wrong with my um? The, this cobalt blue that I have is uh from uh Roman Roman Small, and and it's called cobalt blue light. So I don't know if it. It has like is it because it's called cobalt blue light that is so light, but it just feels to me like it, it's um more like a, a cobalt blue than it is. Uh, like, sorry, it's a cerulean blue than it is a cobalt blue. Yeah, so that's that's about my uh, weird cobalt blue. And Greg says I still hate Umber. It's only useful because they didn't have it. <laughs> Yeah, but I like how like my umber, my burn umber is from Roman Smalls and it's, it's quite nice. I quite like it. So it's just very fun, like easy to use. Ah, oh, people's least favorite colors are also the most useful, the phthalos. Yeah, the phthalos are very, very strong. Um, I think they are, they are, they are very good colors, but I, I don't like them too. Like, uh, I think everyone knows I hate halo um dioxazine. Like the reason why I hate dioxazine is because it's so strong and it overpowers everything. So I think phalo has this problem as well. So yeah, those are those, these are the colors that everyone hates. And yeah, everyone likes the you know the cobalt turquoise, the cobalt violet, the pink, the pinkish colors. So those are the colors that people like. Okay, I am trying my best here to hopefully be able to, to, to show a bit of uh, fur details. Okay, I find like my my brush is this is gonna take me a long time, but yeah, it's a, it's actually fine. Like I I'm I think it's a very small piece, so it's still alright. Um, Gina says, oh, I took art in school. I only got a one time. It was abstract. I didn't start until I was thirty six. Yeah, it's never too late to learn. You know, it's never too late to to get into art. So it's actually it's okay. Like when I start, when I did art, um, I think I liked art since a long time. Like when I was young, I am I love art. Um, I like to paint. I like to draw. Uh, I especially like watercolor. So I like when I was young, I would go to school. I would go to like the library and I would borrow. Um, watercolor books, like how to paint this in watercolor, and I, I would actually like, like kind of force. I would force like my like when I did well in school, like mom would my mom would ask like, oh, what would you want? Like I would give you a little reward, and I would ask for like color pencils. I would ask for paints, and I would like look. I would try to. I would save money. Uh, I, I you know my mom would give us like pocket money. I would save my money, and then I would buy. Uh, watercolor sets and I would go to the the stationery store and I would just buy uh, no I don't buy <laughs> I'll just look at them 
and I'll go like, oh, this is so expensive. I can't afford it. But yeah, I'll just go there like every week and look at the set. <laughs> so that's about art. <laughs> yeah, not having it. <laughs> it is. Yeah, it is. It is. <laughs> that's all. Everybody's hating this palette, huh? Everybody has so many ideas. Like the squirrel's tail look like a whale itching head first with them not open a little bit. <gasps> okay. <laughs> okay, everyone has this, you know, way of seeing the squirrel. <laughs> if I, I would do another watercolorist palette, I just use cobalt and burnt orange. Yeah, yeah, cobalt blue and burnt orange make very good, very beautiful colors. Um, actually, I think cobalt blue with uh, burn umber does make good color. I don't know what what like why cobalt violet is there. Like, I have not even used cobalt violet, so I will have to attempt to use it a little bit. <laughs> the only cobalt that I had had was cobalt sea blue from Roman Smalls. Ah, oh really? Sea blue? I I mine is cobalt blue. Like, that. How does cobalt sea blue look like? That's interesting. Yeah, I, I haven't done the violet. Okay, let's let's use a bit of the violet. I feel like I should I, I feel like I have to use violet. So we will mix a little bit of violet. Oh, and Nancy says, Oh man, oh uh, hippo, are you trying to save the S? Were you like cut off? Uh Nancy, I didn't have cobalt violet, so I substitute with permanent violet in Paul Rubens palette and it is a deep violet. Don't ask the number. I don't know. Ah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Yeah, a lot of the um Chinese brands or like the palettes don't have a color, like they don't give you the pigment information. So it's actually okay. If you don't have it, it's fine. Yeah, we we yeah, it's, it's okay. It's okay. Yep, 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 yep. So there is a little bit of like uh I don't know, I'm just gonna do a little bit here. Maybe on a face as well. I don't know, like maybe just a bit here. <laughs> I don't know if that makes sense. So I, I'm just trying to add uh, a bit of violet whenever I can. So that this piece has a little bit of violet in like a little bit of violet in it. Oh dear. Yeah, I, oh, I know Gina is uh, very proud of a gouache from Paul Rubens and she uses it as a uh, watercolor. You know, I think there was once, I'm not sure if it's Marie's or is it Paul Rubens? I think it's Paul Rubens um, that you guys mentioned about the shiny set, right? The set where they have the glittery colors. Yeah, I, I nearly got it um, from Taobao because you know how 11, 11 just went by. And I got like some art material and art stuff. And and yeah, I nearly bought it. I nearly, I nearly bought it. In the end, I didn't because I thought I just, I have too many art materials. I feel like I need to go on a no-buy like V for where she actually did try. She tried a, I don't know how long was that? I don't remember how long she did the no-buy. I think I should do a no-buy. But somehow every time I said I would try, I, I feel like I'm just half-hearted about it. <laughs> I never really go into it, you know. Oh, your friend, a classmate in high school gave very... Oh, wow. How did you scold it from work? Like, how did he steal the uh, Winston Newton pen watercolor? How did he, how did he do that? But I mean, Winston Newton watercolor is so expensive. Like, I, I, I'm sure he's um, like at work, right? His boss, got, like the uh, shopkeeper is going to keep it like behind the counter, you know, locked up and everything. You know, like um, at the art stores, like we have an art store here and it's called like, uh, what's that one called? Um, art Friend. And the really expensive um, art uh, palettes they are like kind of behind locked glass cabinets and those are like a few hundred dollars like maybe like five hundred dollars and up so those are like behind you know like you can't even you could have to like kind of ask them to bring it out for you and some of the brushes are also there so there you go <laughs> yay at home no not really i don't really i don't I, I can't I don't classify I don't think that was like an art hall it was yeah it was just 
okay. <laughs> it wasn't really an art hole, art hole. Um, yeah, but I did get some like tiny palettes. I don't know why. Like I will always go for tiny palettes for some reason. Uh, more tiny palettes to review, but I love them, so I don't really mind. I think it's okay. Hold on, how is this gonna look? Oh yeah, okay, like this. Okay, so this is like kind of like underneath. So I am just gonna. Yeah, that's right. Okay, and it's gonna go up here. Okay, so the trick to this is just paint with very little, uh, um, very deliberate tiny strokes. I think especially with animals, um, I think the way you paint is different. And Chris, Chris says, uh, the squirrel is called Sammy. He told me. Okay, all right. <laughs> Let's call him Sammy the squirrel. <laughs> <laughs> he's nuts okay what he works in the art supply store maybe he he was good like maybe his boss gave it to him because he was uh he did well maybe maybe he sold the uh, i i don't know you know things anything can happen so it, you know it's also i know someone um uh, he owns a art shop like i, I wouldn't say he owns okay his his family owns an art shop um, and sometimes when I go, um, I would like ask uh, if there were like new stuff, and um, they would he would show it. He would he would he would like sometimes just give me stuff, so really really nice. Um, but he does that to all the sketches as well, um, and I think it's really nice uh, of him. So uh, maybe he just your friend ask. Um, the, the, his boss was happy with him, so he gave him a set of uh, Winsor Newton paint, you know, maybe. Hmm. Okay, and Gina says, yes, I can't bring myself to use gouache like acrylic. The tubes are 15 mil, but I like them to last. They look, ah, okay, that's really good. <laughs> nice for you, nice. Yeah, I I do have like I don't know if you guys remember like my Mia is still there like I sometimes do use it like time to time, yeah. But somehow gouache, I don't know. I feel like for gouache you need you really need to you use it differently. I feel like I, yeah, it's a different way to use gouache. Um, uh, than it like ver versus like it's very different, uh, from watercolor. I don't know, but I, I guess if you dilute it enough. Uh, it, it it might be watercolor. So yeah, it really depends on the the uh, concentration. You know how how you choose to use it. So I'm trying my best here to to get a bit of more of a texture on his fur. It's not easy. So I I do hope that here I I would have more. Maybe I just do a little. Whoops! Yucks! And then he says that uh, Chris is, uh, is taking over Rhapsody skill. <laughs> the Sammy, the nuts, the crazy uh, squirrel. <laughs> oh, okay. So he posts, I worked in the art school. Uh, in school, everyone stole supply. No. Uh, okay. <laughs> how, how do you do that, actually? Oh, interesting. How do you know like people steals? Or, or they, they just kind of brag about it, like, hey, I, I, I took this one. I, I guess like the what's the most commonly stolen thing? Like erasers? Just wondering. <laughs> oh, like working in the candy store and art store. <laughs> yeah, I guess for ours that would be like the candy store. Oh, Chris says, can you ask DIJS Pro to be a little <laughs> quieter while, while he's building Lego? Oh, no, he's not building it yet. So I think I would, um, just very excited that our, or his uh, Lego room is is in the midst. Like next week, we're going to start, like he's, the construction is starting next week. So yeah, we will have our Lego room really soon. And uh, he would be, uh, I, I guess he would be spending more time uh, once it's ready. Uh, and he'd be building up all his, like, um, he has amassed a lot of, like, a few sets of, many, many sets. I don't know how many sets he has of, of uh, Lego, uh, build, like, and, and non-Lego stuff, like the uh, Chinese um, bricks. I don't know what brand they are. Like the Kada, they call it. 
right? And 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 it is just sitting like the boxes of them like unopened are just sitting there because he's just waiting for for this project to 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 complete. And once it's done, we'll see. I I don't know. I'll probably see less of him. <laughs> he will probably be stuck, you know, in the room fixing Lego. Um, yeah, I, I I might be joining because you know, like my my role as a sorter, I'm I'm the sorter for for his uh, for the builder. He's like the master builder. He goes and uh, he knows what to do, and, and he he would tell me like what what to get, and I'll just sort it according to colors and size, and yeah, it's fun. <laughs> there. Yes, yes, I will. So once our Rego room is ready, I'll show it. Uh, don't worry, okay, it's coming. <laughs> oh, you work in a store and they check before you leave to go home. What do you mean? <laughs> do, we, do you mean they don't trust you? That's I don't know. I feel like that's that's not right. Like <laughs> why do they check? I mean, hmm. I mean if I were if I were working there, I'll feel a bit insulted. Like, what do you mean you have to check my bag? Do you not trust me? But okay, I used to work in this uh, uh, a store that sells dry goods. Okay, I don't know how to describe dry goods. Um, so for for Asian cooking, there are all these like dry provision group goods, like dried shrimps, dry uh, mushrooms. Um, nuts, uh, I don't know, preserved fruit, fruits. And I used to work in one of those um, shops. And while like the shop is not always busy, but and uh, when we were not busy, when, when it's like the downtime, um, I, I, we would like me and a few other people working there, would actually just kind of help ourselves to the food, you know, like because they were be having, they have like, um, as I said, right, these like uh, preserved fruits that are kind of like tasty. They are like sour. Um, I don't know how to describe, but those these are stuff that are taste really good. And are snacks, so you would just be snacking, and the bosses are actually fine with that, and and some sometimes. The bosses, the boss, our lady boss, okay, she would she would be sharing it with us. Like she would be like, hey, 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 let's try this. And she she would just, you know, just take it and, and we would all be like eating <laughs> at the shop while waiting. So it, it's a nice, I think it's fun. Like we, we kind of bond over it, kind of. Um yeah, but of course there are like the more expensive stuff. Um yeah, that that we we weren't allowed to 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 help ourselves to, but she's really nice. So she sometimes just like, hey hey hey, just take it, you know, like oh this is this one from this place is really nice. Try this, and she just pass this over over, and we all be trying it together while waiting for customers and stuff. So that was that was a fun thing. <laughs> oh okay, what people stole. Uh, oh, tubes of oil. Wow, and pens. So things you could store. Yeah, I guess so. I, and I mean, I think it should also be things that are available, like in a large quantity, so that if one goes missing, nobody would actually know. <laughs> oh, construction. Um, no. So it's actually a room. Um, that it's an empty room that we convert, like that we convert into a, um, Lego room. But the, the reason why we say construct. It's because we need to like build um cabinets um for for the completed like Legos um fig like uh, build ups, so we had to like construct like a, a kind of a cabinet for it, um yeah which is why it's construct. So that's not exactly like it's um just mainly like woodwork. So you get people to kind of fix um cabinets um, wooden cabinets and stuff and. Yeah, it's it's nothing major, so it's not even taking very long. So I think probably I we should be able to see something like next next week. So I hope to share. I don't know how how much it would be done, but yeah, I hope to share something maybe so you guys can see that. 
<laughs> and Gina says she loved to she loved painting backgrounds. Yeah, it is. Background's fun. I love painting backgrounds. <laughs> and Nancy says, uh, oh, she you used to work in a high school store in a mall when you're a teenager. You had clear purses. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, but oh, high-end high -end store in the mall. Okay. I don't know. Why? Hmm. Have I have I done? Well, okay, I have been, I was a I was a like barista in um uh coffee bean and tea leaf. I don't know if there's coffee bean and tea leaf where you guys are. Um I was a bar barista there. Um and um I believe uh we did tons of weird stuff there. Like um if there was something that we really like uh like to have like bring back like uh because i work the night shift like night shift meaning like the the closing shift so any like extra stuff um that's unsold like at the end of my my uh, uh shift i get to bring it back so sometimes you know my manager will ask like what i would love to like have for breakfast the next day um uh, and yeah, and, and and he we would just you know uh, put things that we we want to bring back home and yeah and there <laughs> yeah so that's that's how that's how it goes uh, when you're in retail. Okay, I'm I'm just hoping that this little guy would not look too weird. Okay, I'm trying my best to have him look as cute as I can. I don't know. It seems like his eyes are too big. Okay, I'm going to give him a little nose over here. It's like tiny little, little nose. Sammy, right? So little nutty Sammy. Yay! I give him a little face. Ah, okay. See, Chris says, I cannot wait to get my room built in my new home. So much to build. Wow, lit it up. Wow, that's gonna be a lot of work. I cannot even imagine leading like lighting up like a small part of the uh building because I think the RGS Pro has been talking about it. Like um like he has always been, you know, where we buy stuff. I, I don't know about uh okay for Lego, like the legitimate legit Lego pieces, uh, most of them don't come with lighting. But for the Chinese ones, the China Kada, you know, the China brand uh, Legos, uh, a lot of them comes with like additional lighting. So, you know, you, you could kind of request to buy it, uh, you know, when when you buy the, uh, during, when you make the purchase. So it's just kind of fun. <laughs> Kidding. Oh. Oh, arts. Oh my God, art space. What, what are you going to do at the art space? You know, there's something that I really like, but I don't think I'll ever get. Do you know, like there are those cabinets that that you can make an art space from and then you can close it when you're done with it. I, I go find it. It's kind of fun. I wish I had something like that, but I have no space at home. Um, I will share it later. <laughs> and Nancy says, I work in a gift wrap. Oh, people would bring in huge, but very, very, very dedicated glass, delicate glass sculpture and expect it to be gift wrapped. Oh, that's so tough. It feels hard. <laughs> I hate to be in gift wrap, but I guess when you're a kid or when you're a student, when you're like kind of trying to earn mm -hmm. some pocket money, those are kind of things that you, you do. And I don't know. It feels very tiring. Like you got to be standing. Uh, I'm going to give him like, give Sammy um, some eyelashes. <laughs> Can you see the eyelashes? Yay! Can I do a little? Oh, you know what I'll do with the, the violet? I'm gonna give Sammy a little flower. Ah. Oh, should I do the flower? Where should oh where should the flower be? Should it be like here? No, I can't, I can't. Okay, I, I have no idea how to paint the flower. <laughs> Poor Nancy. Oh, shoppers are not polite. Oh, horrible. So yes, Hippo, I have given the squirrel a cute little 
cute little eye. <laughs> oh no, I'm having some sort of an issue with the... Uh, uh, hold on. Let me... Okay. Oh, okay. So sorry, I'm back. <laughs> I'm so sorry, the eye disappear. I'm so sorry, I'm back, I'm back. <laughs> yeah, I would like to see too. Um, uh, I like to see uh, uh, Chris Art Space. <laughs> oh, flower in his paws. Yeah, maybe I should. But no, he's holding a, she's holding a, a what do you call that? A, a, a piece of a nut. So he's, He's not holding a flower. I'll do a little flower for him. Like, I don't know if I spoil it by giving it eyelashes. <laughs> it's kind of looking weird now with the eyelashes. So I am uh, just going to do a little, I don't know, like a little nut. So it's just kind of holding a nut. So I'm just going to draw a nut. Hey, hope it looks good. Whoops. <laughs> I'm back, I'm back. <laughs> Walking stick? No. This is a, I don't know, what do they eat? Acorn? I don't know what this is. Like, I think like I'm drawing like a sunflower seed. I feel like he looks like my hamster or something. Oh, no, no, it's not you. It's not you. It's me. <laughs> I accidentally did something wrong to it. It's me. It's me. It's not you. It's me. <laughs> Sorry, trying to sing that out loud. So uh, what I'll do now here is, I, I don't know, I, I'm just going to try to add some colors. I feel like I sh I probably I probably need to <laughs> wear mascara and nail polish. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I'm going to give him a her, him, her, whatever, it, some, some nail polish. Oh, this is so weird. I'm just gonna have a little. I'm gonna give it a. a oh, should I, should I put the flower on? <laughs> Christmas lights around the tail. <laughs> okay, let me just kind of check. Okay, before I'm gonna check that like art thing that I wanna I wanna share. So let me check art closet organization. Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna share. Like, I think these are something that I wanna. No, hold on. This is not it. Um, uh, not app closet. I think it's like kind kind of kind of a organization. Um, cupboard, workspace, cupboard thing. Okay, I can't find it, but once I find that one, I'll let you guys know, okay? Like, I, I remember I saw that one before. It's pretty cool. So, I don't know. I don't think you guys know. Oh, blush! Oh, smart! Ah, I almost forgot about blush. You know how I love doing blush? So, little squirrel, you're going to have a purple blush. I'm going to give you a purple blush. Right, purple blush. Oh, you're so cute. My animals always have like look weird. So he's gonna have like a tiny weird purple blush. Oh, so weird. Like, is the blush supposed to be like here? Like, I guess it should be around here. I don't know. Now his eyes looking a bit odd, but yeah. There. There. Now, I, I, it's funny that I still call him he, <laughs> but it's okay. It's okay. Oh, Gina says, I have built a in I have a building table in my kitchen. I have it full of art supplies and a oh okay that's really nine times twelve. So it's like nine uh inches times twelve inches. It seems like a big space. Let me see nine times twelve. Nine times twelve. Oh that's not very big. This is twelve. This is this is this is twelve. Not very big. <laughs> I'm 
Someone looks like he was punched. Oh no, okay. I'm gonna take it off. Don't worry, it's cobalt violet. <laughs> cobalt violet can be taken off. <laughs> so that's the good thing about using cobalt violet because the color is so light that you can take it off. Yeah, but the eyes looks kind of weird. I'm just gonna give it some, I don't know, like I, I will give it some flower. I will draw a little flower later on on his face. Uh, yeah. So now I'm uh, continuing to add some like details on it. There's all these like texture that I have not like done. So I'm just going to add in. Uh, yeah, I think there's little like stuff going on here. Um, it's always fun to see all these things happening on the face. Yay! <laughs> it's not a nut, it's a karaoke microphone. <laughs> So many ideas, you. <laughs> yeah, I guess it can be. Okay, think what you want. <laughs> this is a karaoke. <laughs> Finish planning the next painting. Let's see if I can get it sketched up to scale. <gasps> wow, amazing. So is it going to be a continuation of your three blind minds? <laughs> and Gina says, I paint a snowman in acrylic and an art sherpa in a live store. Ah, in a live show where she helped me so much. Oh, it's nice. You can share it with us. Um, you have my, I think you, we, we are on Facebook where we connected on Facebook, right? So you can always send me, if you've done anything, you can always send it to me and I can put it together in, in the uh, show and tell. Uh, beginning of November, we're going to have a show and tell. Yeah, looking forward to see if you can, uh, if you would love to, you know, um, uh, we would love to see your art piece. Um, and yeah. Yay, thanks, Suhan. Thank you very much. <laughs> Looks like a risk girl. Yay, thank you. Yay, yay. <laughs> and he posts, I got a table stand to angle my painting and iPad to save. <laughs> hurting my neck. And then she says, I I use full TV trays while sitting on the cedar chest. Hey, you guys should share all your your like studio, your setup. It'd be interesting to see how people paint, you know, how different they are. So what about you? Do you have a good like do you have a dedicated like um uh desk for, for painting or are you just sitting anywhere? Like currently I have a desk, but this desk is um is a shared one, like meaning I'm actually doing work on it uh, when I work from home and then like I have to like kind of clean up <laughs> um, and make it ready for art uh, when I'm done with work. So it's kind of dual use, and but I, I, I don't know. I mean, it works now, but of course, if I have a, you know, finally in the future, if I manage to get somewhere to do my art, it'll be really good. But probably not like in the near future, you know, when I'm still working, uh, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> and Chris says, I'm glad I'm not in 144P this week. <laughs> you know, in the future, I'm thinking um, probably next year, we'll see how or when or whatever. Like I will try to upgrade um, the uh, stream yard so that I can uh, stream at a better resolution. Because now I'm actually just streaming. I'm like pretty primitive. It's only like, um 720 which is yeah like most people some people are already 4k so i am still at like <laughs> for uh, three, uh 720 which is very very sad <laughs> so i am hoping that um yeah i would it would improve the uh the experience for all of you um you will see my art in a better uh resolution yay <laughs> Okay, so I hope that that one of these, uh, maybe next next year, you know, we'll see how that goes. Um, yeah, I did state that it's gonna be one of the, you know, the rewards. And uh, yeah, I I don't know. I feel like I should like. There's so many people who have been so supportive uh, of my art, and I feel like it's time for me to to give to all of you um, by giving you a better better uh, what do you call that resolution? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> it looks it's really looking good. Ugly stage for her. Also. 
Ah, uh, yes, have faith and follow through. That's true. I would not share my art. My art test is messy. No, we're all messy. Don't worry about it. Like who I don't think anyone else here has a clean art desk. <laughs> yes. A green stu art studio. Not at the moment, okay, but one day. Like one day you'll have a green studio. <laughs> And Gina says, years ago when I was married, we would go to the waterfront. I would paint on the TV tray while he is fishing. Good days. Oh, <laughs> so nice. Naughty Sammy is looking good. Thank you. Yeah, so I'm happy that Sammy looks, uh, it's looking decent. Okay, I'm happy he's looking decent. Uh, I will give him a little bit of uh, standing room because if you, if you realize, he... He has not, he's standing on thin air, so I'm gonna give him a standing room uh, by painting this uh, this thing here, like the uh, what do you call this uh, twig. So it shouldn't be that difficult, like painting a twig. Yeah, should be easy. But let's have a bit of texture. So I'll have to paint a little bit of texture. Uh huh. I painted all my. Oh, okay. What? You're so dedicated. You painted all your walls, Craig. You know, like I used to hear someone, like uh, one of the artists um, told me uh, that was because I was actually using a colored uh, washi tape. And he was like, no, no. <laughs> he was telling me, he was, he was like shaking his head and he was saying, he was telling me like, no, Alice, you are using the wrong washi tape. You're not supposed to use a green washi tape. You're going to mess up your, your painting. So ever since then, uh, I will try my best uh, to use like um, like white or neutral color ones. Uh, but, you know, I it's subjected to av availability. So I don't have it. I mean, I, I guess this is still okay. You know, but if I can, uh, yeah, I will use the white ones. Yes, he's a he's a he's a fun guy. Like I I was um I got really close to him and a few other sketches when we went to India. He's an Indian sketcher. Um, he's a watercolorist as well. So he he was really funny and he was a kind of fun person to to be with. Uh, it was a, a good yeah good times uh in in India. So we were in we we uh Vijayawada, uh for a good few days uh to sketch. So it was pretty sad that you know they didn't continue with the this. Uh, they actually had like a kind of a uh, what do you call that? Uh, involved like we the, the government like the Singapore government was involved in the development of the area, but I think they they had a they had a new kind of a regional government and they they kind of dropped that idea. So yeah yeah we we didn't yeah they didn't continue with that plan. So yeah we, we yeah. That, that I felt like it was a good thing. I mean, it was. I mean, I'm still happy that we went. You know, just that it didn't. It didn't become bigger. Yeah, but and it was kind of a nice experience. Uh, I would say, like, people were so fun and they were so so uh, interesting, and they were very nice people as well in India. So I really enjoy my time there. So that's about uh, Vijayawada and my group, my friend uh, in India who, who told me about uh, the washi tape <laughs> color and how I shouldn't use weird color washi tape. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, there. A new year resolution. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, wait, it is. <laughs> it's a sign of genius. We have many mastermind here, right? Only a genius can find. <laughs> and Kathy says, I can't see the top of my desk. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, I think so. And I think I'll stop it. So what I'll do is I'll actually stop it here because as, um, um what's his name? As uh, Hippo says, it's, it's quite complicated right now because the squirrel is has a lot of details so if i were to paint the background it's gonna make the squirrel uh, it's gonna make it less um obvious so i think i'll leave the squirrel as he is little squirrel over here all right and just standing here i will kind of i will find a way to draw a little flower i still haven't thought about how to draw the flower like you should should i have it like coming out here or on here i don't know i'll think about it <laughs> thank you thank you 
Oh, you have two. What? <laughs> you are so smart. Oh, wait, hold on. You say what? Moving stuff over to find whatever's the bottom of the pile. No, I feel like, I mean, uh, I'm not a neat freak, but I feel like sometimes I feel better um, in terms of my mental health when I, I, I make my workspace, when I need to turn up my workspace. So if I feel like very stressed or I feel like I'm um, all over the place, I, I feel like I need to clean up. And once I clean up, I actually feel better. So I don't know whether it applies to you guys. Probably not. I think different people, we probably have more like, I wouldn't say messy, but we are more like interesting people here, you know. So people here, more artistic people. So yeah, so you probably don't have such a problem. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> it is. Okay. I must say India is crowded, noisy, and hot. Yes, it's all three. Dirty sometimes. So you got to be careful. <laughs> but I quite enjoy Like people are really, really nice. When you're sketching on the road, right? Like on the street, they will stop and watch you. And they will ask you stuff and they want to take picture with you. Oh, thank you. Thanks, B. Yay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Yay. I think so too. I think he's gorgeous. So this is Sammy the Nutty um, uh, Squirrel. Okay. So thanks, uh, Chris, for naming Sammy the Nutty Squirrel. He's having, he's eating a microphone uh, <laughs> nut. <laughs> yeah, yeah, please, everyone, thumbs up. Yay. Thank you so much for the thumbs up. <laughs> Yeah, yay. Oh, it's kind of like, no, no, I think, okay, for me, right, I don't know about Indonesia, but Thailand, uh, India are kind of similar because they are very hot. <laughs> it's the, I don't know how to describe, it's humid and it's hot. Like India is, yeah, and they all both serve very spicy food. Like actually not really, uh, I quite enjoy um, India's India food. Um, except that after a while, like if you are there for three days, it's okay. But if you are there for like a month, you're going to die because they all taste the same. It's curry. It's spicy and it's curry. For, for it's, there's nothing, you have no options. <laughs> and Greg says, yes, when I get stressed, my, ah, my, when I get stressed, my art desk is easier. It's easier to clean because it's just putting things in their place it's really relaxing to put it oh yeah like me great high five so sometimes when i feel so stressed um i, I somehow feel stressed sometimes when like my environment is untidy and and the only way to like get less stress is to clean up and when i see things go back to like i i keep them in the drawers i keep things in back in their place i feel better i feel like i can breathe i feel like my brain's not so cluttered so i don't know that's just me so there might be people who are not like like that. So that's, that's just me. Is V also like that? V, do you have a place to you? Like I remember you mentioned that you used to be like, you used to draw with a torch light, right? Like with a light. But do you have somewhere where you can paint now or, or still not, not that? Oh, Greg says, Oh, you've seen a more pleasant pleasant places in people's blog in Thailand. I watched a, oh, a video of a guy crossing the Indian border to a neighboring country. It was immediately better. <laughs> okay. I guess like India is so big, so it's it's just very different. I guess I mean another way to see it is because I was in a uh kind of a guided, kind of a official government tour. So I, I believe people there were maybe nicer to us and they would like actually put us at a, maybe a better place. Like I think we were in one of the better hotels in that area. So, but the, the sound, the noise is real in India. Like it's so, so noisy. <laughs> you wake up to, to just honk, honking and honking. Like you, yeah, you cannot sleep at night because they will be honking at night as well like they just honk like nobody's business um yeah <laughs> so <laughs> if you are like sensitive to sound you might have a bit of a problem in, in, in india but it's an interesting place like you will see very interesting stuff and uh i i think i i think i am very fortunate to 
like at, like I have never expected myself to to be able to visit India at all, and I, I'm kind of yeah happy that 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 you have managed like I managed to so yeah that's I'm happy. Oh, and people says, oh, I bought a IKEA wardrobe to organize. What? You have a wardrobe? I I. I should have done like okay. I I okay. I would say my whole of my whole like I'm in a um the part of that room. It's like my office, our office room. It's a room for our like desk and stuff like that for working and things. And most of our furnitures are from IKEA. But somehow I never thought about buying a wardrobe to keep all my art stuff. I have this uh Alexa like is it called Alex Alexis or Alexa? Oh, wait, hold on. It's not the same. Oh, wait, hold on. Is it Alexis or Alex? Alexa? Oh, Ikea. Alex? Ikea? Is it Alex? Yeah, I have the Alex series. I have the Alex. Um, Alex. Alex. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll share. I This one. Uh, share. Present, present. Share screen. Share screen. This one. So I am I sharing? Yeah, so I have this one, the one in grey. I have the one in grey. Okay. Um to, to to put all my art pieces. I think I believe almost all um almost all artists I know have this one. Uh to 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 just kind of like keep all their A free size art pieces, you know. <laughs> Greg says I, I really love Sammy's ears. Oh, Sammy, love you too. <laughs> oh, so cold. <laughs> Pain says, I still don't really have a functional, a dedicated space to paint. I still store things under my bed and use a tray like for food together things before I set up to film. Oh, yeah. Another, I would like, oh, yeah. So, Pain, um, I would like to warn, warn you that um, it's from my own experience because I used to have a little like footstool, you know, um, that I used to film and I was sitting on the floor to film it and I would put my overhead, my camera overhead and I have to like kind of kneel seat, kneel seat, kneel and sit um, while I film and I, I develop a back ache because of that. So if you are filming, try to be, think of it, think of the, ergonomics and um, be very careful not to like hurt your back from it yeah or if you just paint from for yourself you paint on the bed oh no the bed is gonna be so difficult <laughs> i feel and foolish says you love the cold yeah i love um uh, i realize i love the cold as well <laughs> sometimes yeah they are they are that's true <laughs> it's it's really chaotic <laughs> yeah, she does. <laughs> what, Dark Ellie? <gasps> yeah, I can't. I can't paint in a bed at all. I cannot. How many people? How many people do that? <laughs> no, no, Alexa is Alex. Okay. Oh, hello, Paolo. Hi, Paolo. Yo, yo, how are you? Good. Uh, good afternoon to you. Hey, happy afternoon, Friday afternoon. And Gina says, I have cut stock paper, watercolor tubes in plastic beans under your bed. And that is also a place to keep all your art things. <laughs> yes, I'm so lucky to be mentioned again. Um, she has been really nice. Um, somehow, I think she recently followed me on Instagram. And she has been liking my post, so I've been liking her back. And I think she, she is, is just uh, such a fun person. Uh, and I like her the way that she 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 talks about. Uh, she has so many interests. So you know, like um, Lindsay, right? She's the um, frugal crafter. She has been around for a long, long time. And even before I started painting, right, I already kind of watched her before. And at that time, I remember watching her crafting videos because she started with uh, crafting. And I remember watching her the crafting, and I followed her because I was into crafting. And then like. Yeah, it's just like time flew by, 10 years passed. And I'm like, I'm now doing like watercolor painting stuff. And we were kind of doing it like now. It's just like surreal. <laughs> yeah, I love her. 
Oh no, yeah, please try not to do that. So now B just kind of like want to let you know, like what I do now is I actually, um, I bought a little, uh, I, I placed my my uh, tripod on a, on a, on a uh, chair and then I will just flim overhead, but I now stand. So when I flim, I stand up and I, I just kind of look down. I no longer bend down, except now, like currently, as of now, I'm having some back pain. Yeah, since like two days ago. I think I don't know why I was sitting down too much. So the whole day I was just standing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Oh, she talked about it. Nice. Yeah, I, I think recently I um another of my friend mentioned to me that she 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 did the short run challenge. So I should, yeah, yeah, I should I should I should talk back. I should like kind of reply and comment, right? Like, I, I'm not I'm really bad at comment making comments. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> oh, come on, hippo. I can draw with the iPad in the bed too. <laughs> I can do that. Oh, okay. So you like her, her thoughts on pretty excellent. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, she is. I think she is. She's is Lindsay, she's kind of like been there, been around for so long that I cannot imagine. Like she I feel like she's she's just supporting this whole art community of YouTube, like the art community of YouTube. Everybody knows Lindsay, you know. Oh, you watch her every Saturday. It's called Saturday Chats. She chills us up. Oh, I should I should join her huh? every Saturday as well, just to kind of say hi and say thanks to her. What time is she on? Like, I think Gina says. <laughs> Carlo asks, is the squirrel holding watercolor hot pants? No, he's, he's holding a microphone. <laughs> yeah, but maybe, maybe. <laughs> maybe he's uh, just... He feels, I feel like he's singing, like he's singing on top of his tongue, lungs. <laughs> and he says, I'm going to make you my only friend on Facebook so that I can win free Michael Hardy thing. <laughs> no, you can always come and join us. Oh, I'm on Facebook, so you can always tag me on Facebook. I think most of us have Facebook, right? <laughs> and Chris says, just blue tag a GoPro to your head. Huh? Oh, <laughs> that's not going to happen. But GoPro does have an attachment where you can like kind of like clip to your head, you know, like your hat. Like there's a little clip that you can put on your head, that cap. So that's that might work. That might work. Oh, show us Korean stuff. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, 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 yes. <gasps> there you go. I'm going to do that. Okay. Uh, I'm going to like very quickly show... Things that I got, okay? Okay, I just wanna show you guys things. We have a, we have some fun. Woohoo! Okay, I'm gonna show some art things. You guys gonna be the first to see this. I have a post. There. Okay, you guys gonna be the first to see this stuff because I haven't posted them uh, anywhere, even on Instagram. Because normally I'll just go and post it on Instagram, but yeah, I didn't. So, all right, Korea stuff. Yay. Okay, so, mm, <clears throat> so I got these were, oh, I'm gonna share a video. Um, wait, is it already? I don't remember, but I think I recently just uploaded one video about Suwon, like how you could get the best out of like these symposiums and stuff. So these were done during Suwon time. Um, you will see this in the video. So it's gonna be, I think, tonight or something. I don't remember what time, but yeah. But this is um the the sketches from my second trip to Suwon. Uh, no, 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 Seoul and Korea, uh, Seoul and and Busan. Okay. Oh. No, why are you trying to quit and say, no, why not? What, 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 why? Why are you quitting? But I think Instagram sometimes is a bit like stressful because of the DMs, but I'll talk about it later. But anyway, this is um the flight, you know, we took um this book. This is a traveler's, um, this one, traveler's notebook, watercolor book. But I realized it is not very absorbent. Um... If you are into watercolor, don't buy this one because can you see how streaky it is? It's okay if you are like just painting for fun, but if you are, you are contemplating to like do something like 
more artistic than yeah maybe not okay so but this is um singapore to so light i slept very well <laughs> so just me and my seat and then i was in lotte hotel um in uh, uh what do you call that uh in when i was in seoul so he has a bit of a view um and that's the side these are all the 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 rooms and uh, the, the the view that i got from the room and this is the I went to Changdok Gong, right? Changdok um, Palace. So this is a stamp. There are not a lot of stamps, okay? Fun, unfortunately, in Korea, like not like Japan. Japan has so much, like almost every location has a stamp. Like you can go like stamp your work, right? Like this is probably I was only in Changdok Gong, so I'm not sure if other palaces have it. But this is from there. And this is a tr the the train I sketch on the train. Um, so this we took the train from Seoul to Busan. So this is the train. Um, yeah, I was just sitting there. So that, that I really, I mean, I don't really have much time. Ah, the fast sketch always look best. Yeah, I don't know. It's just fun to do. Like this was from the hotel room when I was in Busan. So Busan is like all about beaches and then uh, the seascape, landscape and stuff. Uh, and I think this is, uh, oh, this was, this was just with... Um, like color pen this was with the multi eight you know the one with the many colors with eight colors in there the the, the color pencil um the lead yeah the pentel multi eight so just mainly that nothing else so this was just from the hotel room that we got and this is Haunde Haunde beach so this is really long beach um, and they have this like pavement and people would be like jogging and there'll be a sunrise here. So I would be posting videos. I already made a video, but I haven't posted yet. But yeah, it's coming soon. All right. No, I didn't see. I didn't see any zombie. <laughs> so disappointing. <laughs> and this was uh, one of the, this is a, these are stickers from one of the shops. So this place is called, uh, I'll share, I'll show you later. Ah, this one. So this is a place, this is a postcard that I bought, okay, from the museum. So this is the shop, like it's in yellow, right? You see it's in yellow. And this is the same shop and it's in, along the coast. So this is like um, kind of a street that's like not, it's like a little area, town or what, like a few, many, many like buildings built on top of each other and just along the coast. And they face the sea and then you know you could just sit there and like um look at the sea view and just kind of buy stuff and this is um they have a lot of cats there and they they, they sold all the cat stuff in, in this place so it's called like the lazy cat cafe so i'll show you which is why i got so many cat things ah okay i'll show you <laughs> so i took this one remember i did the cafe hopping um video so the Lazy Cat Cafe. So this is the Lazy Cat Cafe, the, the little like napkin. I thought it's so cute. Um, and I I just, yeah, bought it back. <laughs> it's so cute, right? And this was from the Dottori um, Garden. So this is in Seoul. I think this is uh, very cute. So I, I kept these because they are so cute. And then these were the other stuff. And this was like the free sticker that they gave. Yeah, that's a napkin. So I, I remember Greg saying that um, his mom, draws like paints on this one paints on a napkin so these are like the special napkins that they have and i didn't want to throw it <laughs> what my quick sketches are my best work do do more to share on youtube really what really i don't know like to me it's is it good i don't even know if it's good like to me it's just um like kind of a pre-study kind of thing so I think I also have the tiny ones, but I didn't have time um, to sketch on a tiny one this time. So yeah, these are the really tiny ones. Um, like this was, uh, yeah, on Swasu one, but I didn't have time to sketch on this one. So I didn't do it. Maybe we could do like a 100 sketch uh, in, in 100 minutes or something, like one sketch uh, a minute. <laughs> no, that's, that's going to be difficult. I, I believe I spent about like the most half an hour on the sketches. So it's not exactly quick, quick either, but yeah. But it's 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 fun to be able to 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 draw as well, you know. Ah, oh, yeah, yes, yes. My video just got posted.
So if you would like to see um, what to know, how to make your like sketching, um, make your events more unforgettable, um, like if you're joining a symposium of an Asia Link sketch walk, what you need to prepare, what you need to take note of. So just go and watch that video, okay? Um, has tons of stuff about my artwork, what happened in Suwon. I'm not sure if I share it. So anyway, I got this one. It's not exactly art stuff, but it's like a little pop socket thing, you know, like how you stick this to the phone. And it's a cute little cat. So it's so cute. <laughs> I like it. And um, this is a little cat in a uh, cat in a box, which is uh, like, I don't know. I think it's a post-it note. That's why I got it because it's so cute. So cute. And then these are the other stuff. Oh, I tell you, like I have so many of these things from there. Um, so this was, I happened to have like be on some sort of, a, there was a like an art fair. Uh, at the hotel that I was staying at. And this was one of the artists. I think this is really cute. Like, these are gummy bears. <laughs> like, these are just gummy bears. And she is so cute in the sense that um, they, they had, like, um, she, she's painting it in a, like, traditional ch um, Chinese painting way, you know? And then, um, but she added, like, cute little gummy bear figurines all around, which is, ha, ha, ha. <laughs> Pretty cute. So this is the artist. She's called Jo Eun Ah. Yeah. Okay. So if you'd like to see her artwork is here. So this is one of those that I, I took from there. And these are the other artists um, that I went to Gamchong. So this is the Gamchong Cultural Village. So they have the stand map. Um, and you could just buy this one from their like, so, like visitor uh, center. And they have all the whole guide, like the map of all the routes that you take. Um, and we took the two-hour route and we took, like, we went and stamped, we did all the stamps over here. So we visited the whole place. It took us, I think, about two hours to complete. And the place is pretty hilly, as you can see from here. It's crazy. It's very hilly. It's very, very... Um, it's madness. And then there's all these artworks that you can kind of go through. So it's really, really fun. So this is this is so nice. Okay, so this is a nice place. So if you're in Busan, right, I would suggest going to this place because this is one of them. I think very it's a very special place. And here are the um they have a they have a little store, they have a little place where they have these uh, art um work by the uh, residents of that place. Okay. Um this one as well, a cute little porcupine and a rabbit. And then these like um, I think these are uh, the very different art, right? This one is like kind of abstract, and this is also kind of abstract as well. And then you have like, all right, this who's this Andy Warhol? Is this Andy? Yeah, Andy Warhol, right? <laughs> oh, more rabbit. I have two of these. So, do you guys want it? Who wants it? I can give it to you because I actually have two. So, I have two of these. <laughs> and this is also one of the yeah, so many of these art stuff that I actually got from there. Um, and some of these are really cool. So yeah, all these, I have all these stuff. And like once you are done with the um, the, the, the map, right, you also get these like uh, postcards. Uh, they will give it to you for free. Yay! <laughs> Who wants it? Who wants it? So I have all these postcards. So I might just send it out. Like remember, I have to send you guys the sticker. So I might send out some of these if you like to. Um, yeah, maybe I'll put it up for y'all to choose and y'all can take it. Like, you can choose which one you want. Uh, maybe next next week, I mean, the next, when we did the do the next uh, limited palette challenge, uh, when we do the show and tell, uh, I will let you guys choose, like, what postcards you, you choose to take, okay? Yay! Yeah, they are awesome. I love them. I think they are very cute. Um, and what else do I have? Okay, these are no, no. Okay, I I also have this one. Like I thought this is a, such a cool thing that they have. It's like a Busan. Um, like a I bought this from a souvenir shop. So what they have is a water brush, right? It comes in a set like this, and then um, what they have here is is like a like a palette it says your soul palette so it says here mix my own small atelier colors the soul and like it's a little instruction booklet how you can paint how you paint uh, watercolor and then they they and she um and it also has this uh little thing 
Okay, so it goes like that is this um, postcard here, like watercolor paper. And this one um, has these like sketches, like it's already done, like the line work's done, right? With this like final piece that you can make. So this is of the, uh, I think it's the Giwa, oh, I don't know. It's like another beach in, in Busan. And they have these, um, ooh. what happened to my white? Okay, so there are these like color dot, dot cards, dot things right, that you can use to paint. But I don't know, it's so little. Like, how are you going to use it? I, I feel like this is not enough. This is so stingy. It's not even raised. It's like so flat. I can't paint with this. I don't know how I'll paint with this, okay? So yeah, yeah. I'm not sure who wants, like, I'm not sure if I'm going to use this or I'm just going to keep it. I am still undecided. <laughs> Yeah, it's so cool, right? So, and I, I just find like, this is not cheap, you know, it cost me about $10, I think. Um, I might have paid like mostly, like most of it's probably for the water brush, which you can see from here. <laughs> yeah, I know, like Paolo, I agree with you. It has a very cool packaging. Very, very cool. So that's the uh, art stuff uh, that I... I mean, I would say like not say art stuff, but stuff that I have from there and the art pieces that I've done and the stuff that I got for myself. I think I bought more stuff from Seoul. Let me think. What did I get? Oh, I got a few things. Wait. Mm. I think I'm going to be judged, but I will share um, that I got another two brushes. So remember, I got this one, so on. Um, I lost one of them, and I found it again in the art shop, uh, in in Hongdae, the Homi Art Store. So I found like they actually have a size zero and a size one. So I got like two of them. So now I have, I think I have three. Right. <laughs> I am like. So kiasu, that's the Chinese Singaporean word. So yeah, I lost. So I got like so when I was in Seoul, I wasn't when, when I was in Suwon, I bought two of these. I lost one of them. So when I went back to Su, uh, uh, Seoul, I, I found it again. So I bought one and I, I decided to get um the size zero as well. So this is the size. Ooh, so this is size zero. Okay, it's from Hua Hong. And there, tiny, tiny, yay, travel brush. Nice. <laughs> oh, Paolo says he's almost stopped buying art supplies. Oh, why? But you need it. Don't you need it for drawing, for painting? I do have two, so I might be giving away one. I don't know. So whoever wants this, this might be in one of the prizes. So I think I've been talking about like doing little cute things for Christmas. So that may might be something else that I will do, like giving out like inexpensive um, and uh, light things to post, things that I can post, but it's light. Um, so that could be one of them, one of the size zero um, travel brushes. Okay. Greg says he likes it. So I hope you win this one. So I will be putting this into the draw. Yeah, I know. Like, I think I should be. Like, I think Paolo, like a while ago, I was just saying that I should be um, doing a little, like, a, 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 a no buy, right? But <laughs> yeah, no buys almost never happen for me. Like, it's always something that I say, but not that I wouldn't do. So yeah, yeah, I'm hoping. And hello, Sarah. Hi, hi, Sarah. Hello. Good evening to you yeah what else what else what else I? oh yeah i got this one too so let me share i think i also got ah this one so i got the mission goal so this is the mission goal gosh okay so this is the so no 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 mission white the mission goal white um yeah i don't know why i got white oh because um for gosh right i i feel like i the white goes out so quickly. Um, let me just show you my whites, okay? So I have a total of... Currently, I have two tubes of white. One from Magello, uh, one from Shinhan, 
and one from uh, Mia, and they are like all kind of dried up. So I think I deserve another gouache. <laughs> what kind of gouache? <laughs> Yay! Yes, that's gouache. That's from Mission Go Mission White. I've not used it yet, but I think it should be the same. Like I don't think it should be any different from any uh, other gouache. Okay. Yeah. What else did I get? Oh, I got myself a watercolor. Oh wait, hold on. I think I got this one as well. Hold on. I don't know if it's a good buy. Might not be. Mm, because I yeah I I this is a Arches hot press um palette like little um sketchbook. I believe it's an Arches sketch. I don't know why I got it from from there. Is this very common? <laughs> Am I stupid to buy it in Korea? <gasps> yes, it's Mission White. Mission White. It is. So they actually have open stock. Oh, hold on. Titanium class. Is it titanium? Um, it. Um, how do I know if it's titanium? Oh, oh, sorry. It's titanium, not white. It's titanium. Titanium class. Yes, this is the Mission Go. <laughs> mission. Mission titanium. <laughs> I don't know. Mission what? Mission Go titanium. <laughs> Yeah, I just got yeah, it's a Archer sketchbook um travel edition. It's a tiny, tiny one, but it's so expensive. This cost me $30. So expensive. So I, I don't know why I got such a small one. Yeah, but it's a tiny, tiny one. Yeah, I, I shall I open this up? No, 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 no. I don't think I should because I don't want it to go bad. But I don't think arches would go bad. Do you guys want me to open up? I could open up to show you guys. Oh, this is the, the arches one. Oh, well, what else did I get? Hold on. I think I also got... Uh, oh, let me... Uh, white Knights. Okay, there. Okay, so I got some White Knights. Um, those, these are all my White Knights. I'm not sure if this one is here. Oh, no, it's not here. Okay, hold on. I have so many White Knights that I don't remember when. Okay, all right. You guys might be opening up. Yeah, it's super expensive. Oh, don't open it. Okay, okay. I wouldn't. So these are all my white knights. Okay, I got this one. I haven't opened it. <laughs> I got these two colors um, from there because I don't think I could find this in Singapore. This is the green, green mist. Um, one of those like super granulating colors. And this one is called Merang Merango. So I'm not sure if Merango is is a common color. It's just a gray. Yeah, yeah. Pigments. Let me look at the pigment. So this is PB15, PBK7, and PW6. Okay, so this is kind of like uh lunar blue, but pastel. Yeah, I think it's just so I don't know why I got this one, but I got it. Oh okay, I would open it. <laughs> Everyone, so uh thank you so much for, for warning me about it. So this is PB28 and PY3. So this is um, cobalt blue and uh, lemon yellow. Okay. I believe I've seen this mixture somewhere. So these are the stuff. <laughs> Not a lot, but these are the stuff. Are these the only things I got from there? I think these are the only things I got from there. I believe I shared this on Discord. I don't remember. I think so. So I didn't really buy much stuff because I don't know. When I was in um, Homey, right, I realized that I thought that there wasn't many different, like, interesting things. Um, I was expecting to see more, like, you know, their, their, their uh, home brands, like um, um, uh, Mangyo um, and Shin Han. In fact, some of the art shop that I went to, they don't even have Shin Han. Uh, yeah, like like the Homey, Homey art store didn't have Shin Han at all. I, I really don't know why, because Shin Han is a Korean brand, right? So I don't know why they don't have it. Um, but when I was in uh, Suwon, I did see Shin Han in a few places, which is why I bought, I helped Siok Art um, with her, with her uh, Vendic Blue, uh, <laughs> Vendic Blue, Vendic Brown. Yeah, so that's that's about it. <laughs> you will never use it. What? You be afraid? What? Why not? <laughs> I'm, I'm struggling to use my nicer. Oh, don't don't wait to use your Saunders Waterford sketchbook. <gasps> don't. It's um Saunders Waterford is one of those papers that that 
are like um that that will give you problems so i think i have to show you guys so i okay i'll have to show you guys what i mean because this is um this is saunders waterfall so i got the not very thick so i, I bought like water sheets watercolor sheets and i cut them up so that i can do you remember i used to do these I still feel like I this is something that I would like to do more often. These are all these that I make. I, I feel like I should make more of these, but I just have no time because I have all the other stuff to do. Um, yeah, so I actually did have still have a lot of these to do. And I realized that because Saunders Waterfall is so turns bad really easily, I'm gonna show you how bad it became. Um almost all my Saunders Waterfall that's being cut up have turned bad. So how do you know it turned bad? Okay, you have to put water on it. So I don't, I'm don't. i not sure if this one has turned bad. Okay, this is still okay. If some are not. So what you can do is that I, I would like just kind of... Maybe I should... This one... This one is okay. Okay, this is still fine. This one is fine. It didn't turn bad. Yeah, maybe there's a speck or mold or something. But this is okay. Yeah, maybe I should show you guys the one that turned bad. Yeah. Uh, there were a few that went really bad. Okay, like this one. Yeah, I'll just quickly show you. So, it, can you see? Can you see it went over? So, I was actually painting here. And it went over the side. You see all these little dots? So it just, these are just the paper, the sizing gone. Yeah. So Saunders Waterfall has this problem. Um, yeah. So I, I think if you have any Saunders Waterfall, please use them as quickly as you can. So it went bad because, yeah, uh, you, you can see the sizing going off. And then you can actually, when you use it, you can actually see the, can you see like the color looking a bit like, it, it's a bit, um, it's not crisp anymore. It just kind of diffuses out. And then you see like at the back, um, this one. I think what I saw, I showed you just now, right? This one, like you could actually see these little dots. Like it just kind of, you feel like the, the, the water gets absorbed to the other side. It becomes a bit weird. And, and you see all these dots on the other side. That's how bad. Yeah, so if you have paper that doesn't work, that's that, and, and yeah, that's how it is. So what I do is sometimes I would just, like use water on them and I'll see if it goes over to the other side. If it does not, it's okay, it still works. But if if I start to see like specks, little like dots of things over, it means the paper has gone. It's gone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bad skincare. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. So that's about all my art adventure in Korea. Okay. So um, yeah, I will probably consolidate all the stuff that I'll be giving out, uh, like the postcards um, and all the art supplies, because I do have some art supplies from Suwon as well, which I would like to give up together with the sticker, which I think most of you here uh, will be getting. So Chris, and Paolo, are you sure you're not gonna try to submit something so that you get like to get the sticker and maybe postcard and 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 like a and like a paintbrush, you know? Try it, try it. Hi, <laughs> Greg says, I used to be precious about watercolor paper. Then two of my sheets went bad and now you might use them up. <laughs> Hyper tried. Yeah, I am. Like now I try to use up as much as I can as well because I think it does not make sense to, to let it turn bad. Yeah, unless you have like um, a silica gel cabinet. Um, you know like how art, like um, photograph photographers, um, they, they, they used to uh, keep like yeah, camera equipment, stuff like that. Like unless you have those stuff, I think it's yeah, like you shouldn't like leave chance. You shouldn't give it chance. Yeah. Ah, okay, okay, all right. But still, mm. and Gina says that uh she buys six pack sets of uh Kenson XXL. 
it's okay. Cancer and XL is, is not too bad. It's it's just a multi. Um, I guess it's not for like watercolor, watercolor kind of thing. Hmm. <laughs> eyes. <laughs> okay. What happens if your your paper has eyes on it? Oh no, zombie is no good. Yeah, true. <laughs> Okay, all right. Please work hard. Yes, please work hard. Oh, the due date? Oh, well, I think before, um, maybe before the end of this year, as long as you submit something, like before we start the next year, uh, I will be sending this out probably after the new year because um, there are a lot of things happening and like I believe the mail will be crazy, you know. I would believe it's better to send it out like next year when things are a little bit more calm when the new year has started. So you have time, you know. I don't think I want to like do it before the end of the year. So yeah, that's probably you have time. Oh, cool, cool. Okay, please do that. Okay, I'd like to see a flower painting from you since you're one of those uh, flower finger people, flower finger, plant, plant finger, green finger people. What? So I think I, yeah, today we have, um, this is probably the end of today's session. Um, and with Sammy, the squirrel, I'd like to thank all of you uh, for joining me today um, to, to, it was, it started off really hard, like Rocky, because I couldn't paint him. But I think it, it, it turned out okay. Like I could get some loose edges, which I like. I could get some of the texture in. But I think I still need, I probably need to use the uh, Mission Gold Titanium Plus to uh, do some like white. Or oh, I might use gel pen. No, I think I probably use gouache and I'll just like give him some white. And uh, I might paint a little flower somewhere. Yeah, but that's probably it. That's probably it. And Gina says, we have four seasons here in Washington. It's nice, but long gray winters. Ah, uh, okay. I paint just as well on. Yeah, it does not matter. I think it does not matter. As long as you paint, as long as you draw something, it does not really matter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Chris, no, you don't. <laughs> don't do that. I think... I think pain. Um, I think a uh, foolish one is uh, probably has probably fallen asleep. So he didn't hear that. <laughs> you have to do it yourself. Okay, you can't hire him. <laughs> stop, stop. Well, then again, you might maybe you can bribe me with some Lego. <laughs> you might want to send me some Lego, and I would send the sticker to you. <laughs> Thank you, Sarah. Thank you. Oh no, you don't. Well, there's some paper that is pretty bad for painting. Uh, like your photocopy paper, <laughs> that's pretty bad for painting. So everyone paints really bad on that one. <laughs> yeah, Gina has to, Gina says it right. Like bad or good is fine. Just keep on practicing. Yay. <laughs> Can you paint it? Hey, your past apples, you know, you had the chance to paint apple flowers. But it's past, but it's okay. You can paint apple flowers. Um, yeah, you can. <laughs> you can. <laughs> of course you can. As long as the colors. In fact, for next for next month, um, you can paint whatever you want. <laughs> oh, of course, no AI, please. Um, I'm not that I can tell. I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't think I can. Hmm. I if it looks perfect, I'll smell a rat. If it looks too uh, polished, I'll smell a rat. <laughs> because traditional art is supposed to be a little bit different. Are you gonna submit AI? Are you? I thought you're against AI. Hmm. Are you gonna do that? <sighs> Okie doke. So I think that's probably the end of it. Um, I will end here. Um, I hope that I'll okay. I'll see you guys again next week. Next week, I'll be painting a portrait of our man, handsome looking man. Um, and uh, yeah, see you guys again. Um, and have a great week. 
everyone and watch the video because um, it will tell you what to take note of when you uh, go on urban sketching or when you go on a trip uh, for symposium and everything, okay? Thank you. Oh, CB says that he has uh, sent... Uh, uh, what? You sent your submission. Okay, all right. Thank you. Cool. Make a, the squirrel into a sticker. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, maybe. I'll think about it. <laughs> Thanks, Sarah. Thanks, Hippo. Thanks, Greg, Paolo, Gina, Chris. Yes, I will check the Discord. Yes, yes, I will, I will. Is it a personal message or is it a message on... Uh, uh, now, now, okay. All right, okay, cool. Uh, I Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, everyone. <laughs> Let's look at what uh, Chris has submitted. Where did you submit? Oh, <laughs> Chris, that's cheating. <laughs> what? That is my work, Chris. <laughs> so let's see what he has shared with us. Uh... <laughs> I'm just going to quickly share Chris' work because he... <laughs> He's cheating. Chris, that's cheating. That's my work. That's not your work, Chris. <laughs> no. So you cannot... I would like to see your tomato, okay? <laughs> no, that's my squirrel. You're wrong, Chris. It's okay. Just submit the tomato. Oh, no, no, no. To apples. Top apples, okay? <laughs> Bye, everybody. See you guys. Don't cheat, okay? <laughs> no cheating for you. Send me some Lego. I'll send you the sticker. Lego for sticker. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye, everyone. <laughs>